Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to a windy, rainy, very miserable Juma. It's really raining sideways at this stage. It's not heavy yet, but it's coming. Our boundary looks like a wall of water coming our way, so it promises to be quite an interesting afternoon with the rain. So if there's a few rain spots on the lens, I do apologize, but well, We'll try our very best. It looks like the sun is trying to, it's hard to break out in patches, but unfortunately it doesn't look like it's got much chance because the only open patch of cloud is on this northern side where the sun is at the moment. And other than that, it looks pretty ominous all over the place. So I think we're in for a really wet afternoon, but a fun one nonetheless. Hopefully the wind will die down and then it will all be actually quite entertaining. And hopefully, We'll find Ellie's out, because Ellie sometimes like to swim in weather like this if the wind does drop. So we maybe we'll see them moving around. Oh, hang on a second. Did I see what I think I see? No. Oh, I got excited there. I thought there was fresh little leopard tracks for a young female, but it's not. It was just a small hyena. That was almost going to be a very exciting start to our afternoon. But the good news is, is that apparently Tingana, Mr. Last Minute Leopard, has crossed onto Juma at some stage during the day. So I'm trying now to head to that sort of direction. Apparently he was near Buffel's Hook um, Dam, that area. But the chance of him still lying there, as we know with Tingana, is not always very good. So I'm going to try and see if I can't head there and hopefully, just hopefully, with this miserable weather that we've got, he's decided to find himself a place to lie down and rest. And so that's what I'm going to cling to. But at least there is some hope for this afternoon. We had those Ellie's as we finished drive this morning, and it was fantastic. Craig and I actually stayed for an extra sort of 15, 20 minutes after the show wrapped because as we were leaving them when the show finished this morning they, they were all coming out onto the road and eventually we ended up with a situation where some of them were lying on the road and they were dust bathing and the babies were climbing on some of the adults it really was quite something but unfortunately it just happened all five minutes or so too late because we couldn't by then bring back the stream so hopefully they'll be around they look like they were going to be settling for the day around Chitwa so I'm hoping we'll find them and then, well, anything else that we can find. I know Byron's looking forward to this afternoon. He's in high spirits as always and as chirpy as ever, which is good. It promises to be an entertaining afternoon when Byron is chirpy. He's like a little budgie sometimes. He just chirp, 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 chirp all day long. And it is quite fun to be around him in camp. He's definitely lifts the spirit of things, that's for sure. And I hope you're all settled now and ready for us to go. <laughs> Craig, are you ready? No, not really. Craig is giving me the um because Craig is still battening down hatches, zipping up zips, velcroing velcro and trying to get everything sorted so that the rain doesn't come and affect the bat cam. The bat cam is a powerful beast but is a bit sort of susceptible to the rain and so the rain and so we need to be careful of bat cam and keep bat cam nice and dry and get it into its little cave. Now I'm not sure about whether Mara is joining us this afternoon, but I would hope that they are. It would be nice to see the familiar faces of the Mara again. I'm sure they're looking forward to being out and about. I know they've been busy, hard at work, trying to get to know all the characters that side and trying to get some sort of background history on everybody. And so they spend most of their days driving around in the reserve, finding as many animals as they can, and then they then join us later in the afternoon. So hopefully they'll be out. Right, that's all we've got time for. It's now time to actually get things underway and get things a little more serious. And so let's go across to Byron and we'll see you all in a little bit.